What's up, Van Clan, and welcome back to the channel. I'm so excited for today's video. I don't want anybody to hear me. Today, I'm going to pick up the kids' Christmas surprise. It's just camo. Um, <laughs> it's actually Garrick and the kids' Christmas surprise. I've been waiting for this day for so long. I'm excited, and I'm going to take you guys along with us. I have to go to the airport to pick up their surprise. You guys will see in just a few minutes, but I'm so excited. Let's go. Okay, I'm sneaking off. So the kids don't see me. This is also the first time I've been away from all the kids in a really long time. Like it's crazy and it feels weird to me because I'm not even bringing Ocean. I normally bring her everywhere, but I decided it might be less hectic if she just stay at home because I really won't be gone that long, but it just still does feel so weird. I'm so excited, you guys. I have to stop at the bank first and get something to eat because I'm hungry. Yeah, food is definitely a must. I hope I have time for that. <laughs> We went to the bank, now I'm at Chick-fil-A. Thank the Lord it was right next door so I can eat. Hi. Can I get a name, please? Zoe. What can I get you? I'm gonna do a deluxe. I'll do a sweet tea. Here you go. Thank you. My pleasure. I can smell it, y'all. I'm so excited. Okay, I ate. I just pulled up to the airport. I don't know why I'm so nervous. I'm waiting for my pet transporter nanny. <laughs> to be here i think they just landed i am so giddy and so like nervous for some reason i don't know why just to give you a guess of what i'm here for i for real have no idea what to expect like how does this work am i just gonna grab them i say them because it's plural if i didn't already say that i don't know if they're gonna like get in my car so i need to do i need to clean it i don't know lord knows it is not clean down here. Oh my gosh, y'all, I see them. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. How was your flight? Good. Good. So we got your two little babies. Okay. Do you want us to open the door? Yeah, or? you can. I've never done this before, so okay. I'm like, how does this work? Do you have a carrier for I them? I do, I have okay. a carrier. So let's transport them into the carrier. Okay. I may do it through the window. I just have to get a picture with you holding them. Okay. So that's the rambunctious one. The other one's very chill. Okay. So like, <laughs> this one's very chill? Yep, yep. yeah. Okay. Oh like sleepy. I know they're so cute. Awesome. Thank you. Okay, yeah. hold on. Let's see, I can help you. Thank you. How did they do on the flight? Oh, they were so good. Really? Mm hmm. Pretty chill. What a fun job. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Perfect. Oh, thank you so much. Well, no problem. We appreciate you. Hi. Safe travels. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe I have them right now. I'm about to go park and like debrief. I can't believe I just picked cats up from the airport. God, they're purring. Stop. So these are therapy ragdoll kitties. You guys are so cute. I cannot. Oh my goodness. You guys know we have kitties. They're very feral. They come in and they immediately, they just want to be outside all the time. I have been reading a lot about therapy kitties and I've been searching for months and I finally found these two boys from a therapy ragdoll breeder. And I was like, this would be so perfect for Christmas. I wish you guys could feel them. They're so soft. I want to sit here with them forever. But we got to get home so I can show you. And show the kids. Yes. They're so snuggly. If you've never heard of therapy ragdoll kitties, just give them a Google. There's such a difference in the way that they're bred. Y'all, I used to make fun of like the crazy cat people that only bought a specific breed of cat, like a cat's a cat, right? Well, was I wrong? A cat is not just a cat. They're bred specifically for like certain characteristics and ragdolls in general are just known to just be extremely loving and affectionate and like the golden retriever of cats. You guys, the kids are gonna freak. Okay, let's get home, y'all. I don't even know, like what are we gonna name them? I know you guys have had a long day. <laughs> Okay, anyways, I'm about to put this big red bow on, drive home, and surprise my kids. Let's go. All right, you guys, it's dark. I just got home. They slept basically the whole way. Gosh, okay, let's go. Just put them on like a normal backpack. And I'm gonna be like, surprise, I got you guys a new backpack. Here you go. Can I come? All right. Come on Are you, you guys, guys ready? ready? Okay, close your eyes, guys, okay? Keep them closed. Don't pee. Yes, sir. I should I'm so excited. All right, are your eyes closed? Just there, what you can carry 
hello you guys we took the weekend to really just like hang out with them after the last clip that you guys saw we literally just turned off the cameras we played with them we got their toys out who's in love with Bowie and Mako me 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 yeah we named them who is this guys Mako. Come here. Who is this? Mako and Bowie. Mako and Bowie. They're so sweet, huh? Their collars come in today. I they got do? them some collars and an air tag. Yeah, well, air tags. I'm absolutely in love with these guys. They're so cute. Literally, like the best cats ever. I've had I've had some really cool experiences with cats, but bonding with kittens is a whole different experience. I used to make fun of cat people that only got like certain breed cats but it's true that they're bred for different characteristics and their mannerisms are so different so this one Mako that's Mako right yeah mm -hmm. he's a cinnamon mink ragdoll and then Bowie is a chocolate mink we ended up getting two because they just do better in pairs especially because they traveled so far on an airplane I I didn't want them to be scared or anything so getting two of them was kind of a scary decision at first but it ended up being for the best like they're the best buddies the best friends yeah i mean like the the watching them play together is just so cute yeah their little sibling bond is so precious and they've they've like imprinted on all of the kids I know. in different ways and it's just so cute last night when venture went to sleep they went um Dewey and Mako was playing something funny. They were? They were playing and they were hiding from each other. Yeah, they have been sleeping a lot in the boys' room. They find a lot of comfort in the, with, with the boys in their room. Whatever. I don't have a favorite. I like them both the same. <laughs> I hope you um, know. Hazel said she has a favorite. Who's I know. Your favorite? She does. We talked about this. Who's your Bowie's favorite? Bowie? Yeah. <laughs> Even Ocean, the kitties just come and they cuddle her. Yeah. Yes. Nope. I was just nervous because it camo specifically like he's just a big scary thing to a little tiny cat but the good thing is the place that we got them from their breeders actually have a standard poodle so it was like it was they were used to that you like those kitties oh so sweet were you guys surprised when we got them hazel were you surprised when we got the kitties this is how they are almost 24 7. the other half of the time they're playing i'm just so happy that we have them they are just the best i got a halt he's on alert because camo's right here but give it time and they're gonna be the best of friends you better not try to wrestle up these kitties like you wrestled me. They are for real such a blessing in our life. I will say they came at the perfect time because we all got sick and they've just been like so snuggly. So perfect. I'm obsessed with them. Also, I just want to say this is definitely not sponsored at all, but we got them from Cosmic Therapy Ragdolls. I will leave all the information below, but one thing that I've noticed already, they've really acted as a bridge for Hazel, especially during like big emotions and centering herself. But I mean, really acting as a bridge in terms of like socially and especially at bedtime they're just so cuddly and attention seeking it really just like calms the energy i feel in the house because bedtime can sometimes be chaotic huh now yeah we and we got it a perfect time because tomorrow is thanksgiving that's true tomorrow's thanksgiving are we so thankful for them tomorrow yep. is i'm gonna insert some clips here of just self-explanation of how these kitties have integrated into our lives and they're just so perfect and yeah, perfect. i love them I love yeah. them too. They're too cuddly. They're cuddlier than these socks right here. So last night, Bowie came up to me in my bed and it was crying for me. Oh, it wanted you. Yeah, it was literally coming to my bed. They love you guys, you know that? Yeah, especially me. <laughs> we got two boys because we figured that would be like the best dynamic in the house with the girl kitties breeder actually recommended that and it's worked out i feel like bringing in another girl cat would have just been like total chaos in the house because you all know how girls can be <laughs> <laughs> he is just the best cat i love how he plays like i know he's such so a playful cool. kitty <laughs> hey booey booey <laughs> We got this cat tower for the boys room because it has a little shark on it and the boys room is ocean themed and they lay in this hammock it's so cute mopsy and gilly aren't really into this kind of thing because like i said they're just like they like to be outside they're super sweet and we love them so much but they're not cats that are gonna sit in a cat tower inside if that makes sense if you have a cat like that then you get it we're waiting for hazel's cat tower to come in because she's getting a little flower one for her room and it's just been such a fun, positive experience. And I'm so grateful. And the kids are so grateful. And it's just been... I am grateful. I'm so grateful for this. Oh. I 
look at all cat towel, guys. I know, I just showed them. Isn't it cute? Yes, it's the best cat towel ever! You love your kitty. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, we're going to end the vlog here and continue cuddling our babies. I hope everyone has a wonderful Thanksgiving. What? If you like this video, please hit a big thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you have not already. Smash the notification bell. See you in the next one. See you in the next one. Mwah. Mwah.